the Roar Rundown. It's been a couple of weeks, but we're glad to be back in the studio. And you know for opening day for baseball is just six days away. I know, Ryan. I'm literally so excited. Um, so I know that it's probably way too early for me to ask this, but Ryan, who do you think is going to win the World Series this year? Me personally, having family from Chicago, I got to go with the hometown team, the Cubs. But I also like the Yankees. They've made some good additions offensively and defensively in their pitching rotation in the offseason. Yeah. You know, I think those are both strong choices, Ryan, but I really, really think that it's Tampa Bay's year. I think the Rays are going to win it. You know, they've been in the last two years, done really well. So I really just think, I think, I think it's Tampa Bay's year. You just might be right, Katie. Well, the Wachita's baseball team has done well this season after losing to Southwestern Oklahoma State University last weekend. The Tigers won their midweek game against Texas A&M Texarkana on Tuesday. Lewis Stern hit a three-run home run to end the game with an 11-0 mercy rule in the bottom of the seventh. The team is playing the Rangers of Northwestern Oklahoma State University in a doubleheader today and a single game tomorrow. The softball team is 8-6 and six in conference right now. The Tigers are in Alva, Oklahoma facing off against Nwoshu this weekend. The softball team will play at Arkansas Tech next weekend and they'll have a midweek match against Henderson on April 6th. The men's soccer team won its game against Newman University this past weekend and the team's next game will be at Northeastern State University on April 3rd. The women's soccer team is now 4-1 in conference after its 3-2 win over the Rangers this past Saturday. And Tigers will play against Harding in an exhibition game on Tuesday. The men's tennis team is playing at Texas A&M Texarkana today and the Tigers will take on Collin County College in Texarkana tomorrow. Their next conference match will be at Southern Arkansas University on April 6th. The women's tennis team is playing its Battle of the Ravine match at Henderson this afternoon, and the team will play Henderson at home on April 9th. Wachita's basketball teams finished their season the first week of March, but Ryan York caught up with Jacob Street to teach him a, a bit about playing basketball for this week's Back to Basics. Hi, I'm Ryan York. I'm here with Jacob Street, junior basketball player for Wachita, and we're going to go back to the basics. I'm going to help Jacob... Uh, with some of his basketball skills, we're gonna we're gonna learn a little bit. You know, I'm gonna get him up to that 30 points per game ratio, hopefully, and uh, we'll see what happens. All right. So first, we're gonna work on dribbling. The main things to know: never use your fingertips. It's all palm. And then you wanna keep your eyes directly on it. You don't wanna look up, otherwise you're gonna lose control of the ball. All right. So those are just simple tricks. Now I'm gonna show you how to do it, and then you're gonna try. Watch those fingertips. Eyes on the ball. There you go. There you go. That's, so, that's too much fingers. No. <laughs> okay, so now we're going to work on our shooting. It's all about confidence. No one cares about the skill anymore. You have to literally just turn around the second you release the ball. You're just going to throw it, turn around, you're good. You're going in every single time. It's all confidence. I'll show you how it's done. drive in, you're going to get fouled, you're just going to get fouled in general, all the time. Just the pinnacle of free throws, Jackie Moon. We're going to, we're going to show you the form that you use it, okay? Alright. You're going to want to bounce the ball probably about seven times, um, or up to 15, it really just depends on how you're feeling. Alright, so now I'm going to show you what pure athleticism looks like. Uh, I'm going to dunk a ball and you're just going to attempt to make it look like mine, okay? Alright Jacob, so I just wanted to ask, what did you learn today? 
Uh, like you said, just tightened up the fundamentals and, yeah, ready to use them next season. All right, that's good. See you all later. Washita's football team has scheduled three scrimmages for this spring, and the Tigers will play their first one this evening in Cliff Harris Stadium. Baseball is playing a doubleheader against Noish New starting at 1 o'clock today, so be sure to catch that on the Washita Sports Digital Network's YouTube channel or come out to Rab Rogers Field to catch the game. That's all we've got for you this week, but be sure to follow us on Instagram at The Roar Rundown. And as always, stay purple, Tiger Nation.